Anadod is an autonomous analytics company uh, that has a mission to change the way people do BI to be more autonomous. Uh, and we're using machine learning uh, techniques to do that, basically analyzing all the business data of our customers to alert them whenever there is abnormal behavior happening and also forecast the future of their key performance indicators. So this year we launched, the so our first service was in the business detection area, which was anomaly detection and alerting on anomalies and root cause analysis. Uh, we launched this year, in the beginning of the year, a forecasting service uh, on time series. And it has the same, uh, uh, the same mantra as our detection services. No data scientist required, no development, development required. This is really designed for uh, business users that have no coding, uh, no, they, they know their data, but they don't know anything else about what, how to use tools. Um, so basically it's the same mantra of machine learning, very sophisticated machine learning algorithms for for time series forecasting, and what if analysis, but for the business users. So, so when we started, we started on AWS. Uh, so that, that was a decision that we made on day minus something, I mean, even before we actually got the funding. Uh, for the obvious reason, it's easier to build, very, very well proven. Uh, we, we started out by using heavily EC2, uh, basically servers, the networking, anything around that. Um, and slowly we started using more and more services. So we have an EMR, several EMR clusters that, w that we spin up every day for a few hours and, and break down. Uh, S3, obviously, everything around networking, security related products. The user experience around a machine learning based product is as important as the actual machine learning algorithms and results. If you, you can have the best algorithms in the world, if you can't serve the results to users in a way that they understand, it's meaningless. Um, so a lot of the work, additional work that we have done as a company and uh, around the product was to actually serve the results in a way that non-machine learning experts understand it without having to know anything about machine learning. That's actually as hard as the machine learning itself.